I'm James Cullingham. I'm the director and producer of In Search of Blind Joe Death, the saga of John Fahey. My company is Tamarack Productions, and I come from Toronto, Ontario, Canada. My film is about an amazing American musician, a composer, a great guitar player, a wonderful writer, and an all-around iconoclast and provocateur named John Fahey. He is best known as um, the uh, inventor of something called American primitive guitar. I think his contribution, among others, was that he took what he considered to be the classical music of America, uh, Delta blues, New Orleans jazz, and he reinterpreted it as a uh, solo um, steel string guitar music. In the last five to ten years of his career came the biggest surprise when he picked up an electric guitar. And he started playing with people like Sonic Youth and uh, Cool de Sac in Boston. I was rather surprised in 2009, given that he died in 2001, that there wasn't already a film. And I thought, hmm, no one's made a film about Fahey yet. He's kind of like a guitarist player, guitar player. So there's, there's a lot of goodwill towards trying to make a film about this uh, extraordinary individual. London's own Pete Townsend, um, who's in the film and uh, heard Fahey's guitar playing as the Who was starting out, basically. And it may seem odd, you know, the guy who was the loudest electric guitar player in the world probably at that moment, being inspired by this guy who was simply playing acoustic steel string guitar. But Pete Townsend was extremely moved by Fahey's music and it, frankly agreed immediately to be in this film. I had met Fahey uh, as I was starting my career as a documentarist. Um, I did a radio documentary about him for the Canadian Broadcasting Corporation in 1982. He was the guy who would write like five pages of liner notes and basically his albums on his earlier albums are like books. Um, and they're mock liner notes, like he invents characters among them, Blind Joe Death. I was fascinated with him and I admired him and um, I loved his sense of humor. So I had something to draw on in terms of my own understand, my own personal understanding of the, of the guy. And then um, we certainly combed the archives. The real challenge is, okay, we only have an hour. Uh, what do we make the film with? I really, really appreciate that uh, Raindance um, accepted the film. Uh, it will be the world premiere. I'm very, very uh, touched, frankly. I think it's cool, and I'm having a good time. You know, London's amazing. <laughs>